but yeah, seeing the journey too from, you know, like seeing Lori just, you know, seeing you come in and then start and all the growth that you're doing and the joy and the, like you're just sitting on them and you're just smiling. And yeah, you are. It's just, it's just wonderful. And, and I know it's going to be the same with you, Kimberly, and it, yeah. it just, it's amazing. Well, a lot Beautiful of this thing. came from <clears throat> Lori and our lease program because mm -hmm. our lease program has always been different in that, yes, we have horses for lease. No, you are not just going to come out here and jump on my horse, yeah. right? Um, you have to learn how we work with our horses, how we move our horses, how we halter our horses, how we ride our horses, because I'm not as interested in what you need from a horse. I don't know you, you're a stranger. I'm more interested in what my horse needs from you as a rider. So while I can appreciate someone wanting to lease a horse here, if they can't appreciate that my horse is my priority, mm -hmm. this is not the right barn for them, mm -hmm. yeah. right? So we started with the lease program where they just needed to come in and go through our lease program, which is all groundwork with me. And then when I feel like your groundwork is where it needs to be, where you can confidently go get the horse out of the pasture and tack him up and clean his feet, then I hand you off to Lauren and she makes sure that you can mount the horse and guide the horse and back the horse and do what you need to do to be safe in the saddle. And then you get to lease the horse. That's the lease program. But what I found is more than just making sure that you're safe for my horse and my horse is safe for you because you're now my people, I enjoyed what that program evolved into and became with the grounded horsemanship because I watched you change mm -hmm. and heard your feedback that what I gave you helped change my life. Yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and which meant everything to me. And that's big. I mean, yeah. I have not had an easy life either. To have someone like that would have meant everything to me. You know, and, and I'm so grateful to my and all of that, but to be able to give that gift to someone else and to have you tell me that I, I gave you that was huge for me. I, I felt like it was to, to you. Yeah. And and so started working with women that weren't interested in leasing, women that just wanted that experience, the the knowledge, the you know, the time with the horse. Mm -hmm. And it, it, it speaks to like your imprint and your legacy. Mm -hmm. It's a piece of your legacy. Yeah, I, I wanted her to know because yeah. she didn't just, I, in her mind she might be thinking, I'm just out here teaching again, you know, and over and over and then, but really changing my life. The right. skills that you're giving me are making me more confident, conquering fear, you know. The impact is yeah. so yeah. broad yeah. among I know she gets busy working and everything, the day-to-day -day mundane things, but in the big picture, that's what we're doing. This is the best part of my life. Short of ending the day at home with Mark, mm -hmm. starting my days with my ladies mm -hmm. and doing this groundwork is the best part of my life. Because mm -hmm. I'm sharing something I'm passionate about. I'm helping to empower these women. And, and bond with these horses and build this family even more, it's just meant everything to me. I'm so grateful that this evolved into what it has. It's, it's just been awesome. Well, and it's it's like the butterfly effect. Mm -hmm. yeah. What you're doing and then it's in Well, now I have you. a friend who wants to come in January. She said, I want to do everything exactly the way you do. Aww. I want she wants to find an OB too. <laughs> no problem. But she wants to do, you know, she's watched my journey and she just wants to do exactly that. Which is great because that's that's how it works, right? Where Lori comes in at ground zero and works her way up to Lauren and, and we don't even work together that often mm -hmm. anymore, yeah. you know, if, if ever. But Kimberly's come in at ground zero, but you're not always going to be there. Yeah. You know, there's going to be a point where you move off to Lauren and somebody else is going to come in. And so it's great that, you know, a friend of yours is seeing that or somebody, you know, watches this video and goes, I want that, mm -hmm. you know, or I need that. Mm -hmm. Even if it's not, I need to ride a horse. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's, 
to find my confidence. Yeah. 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 You know, I want this sisterhood. Yeah. Th that's yeah. fine too. Yeah. yeah. The comments like you're adventurous or you're brave or I can't believe you fill in the blank. Yeah. And I've heard that through most of my life. But as an adult looking back, I can really attribute it to my horses and my mom who right. yeah. led me to horses. Mm -hmm. But um they are they are that impactful. Mm -hmm. They truly yeah. are. I think awesome your friend is really yeah, really speaks to what Aww. the broad change that you're saying. Yeah. And, what, yeah. and you're sharing. Yeah. Yeah. You know, because it, it just yeah. dudes from you. Mm -hmm. And that's it, you know, and people can feel it and sense it yeah. and, and it, it, yeah. they want a piece of it. Yeah. yeah. And like you said, it isn't just, I want to ride a horse. Right. I learned to ride a motorcycle because I wanted to ride a bike. Mm -hmm. Not just because I wanted to, but I wanted the confidence. Yep. I wanted to know I could, and I didn't want to always be in the ditch seat. Yep. I wanted to ride. Yeah. So I did. Yeah. These animals are not puppy dogs. Mm -hmm. They're right. not, you know, kitty cats. These are a thousand to fifteen hundred pound yes. animals that do not naturally have relationships with human beings. Right. So yeah. to get one to say, hey, where are you going? I want to be with you. Mm -hmm. To follow you. Mm -hmm. You know, not just in a straight line because you have a cookie, but really yeah. join up with you and be with you. Yeah, they choose it. Right. They choose it. And they, they don't have it, to. They don't. They don't right? have no inclination to. No. That's, that's something on a level that I have yet to be able to find a word for. It's not confidence. It's not achievement. It's not, you know, it, there's just, there's not a word. It's just yeah. so majestic yeah. and so yeah. fulfilling. It's almost yeah. divine. Yep. Therapeutic, right? too. Therapeutic, Very too. So. This is my therapy. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. You know? It's a gift. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sure somebody does something like this somewhere. It's not like I'm, I invented something <laughs> new. This just evolved, Into like this, I said, yes. out of out of this basically feedback. my working with yes. Lori um, into what it is. And there is no curriculum. It's not we're doing this and we're doing that right. and we're doing that. It's you know we start in one place and we finish in one place. But what happens in between is pretty much decided by where yeah. the person is at, mm -hmm. and then by what the horse decides we're working on. That uh -huh. day. Tim and I have had this conversation where it's you know. We think we're going to work on sending. We'll go to get Foxy. And nope, we're working on the gate today. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. You know, yeah. and, and we're sending through the gate. Yeah. We're, we're, this is the lesson. Okay, Foxy's in charge. Yeah. Yeah. Agenda you know? gone. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. The many days like that. Yeah, yeah. many Absolutely. days. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it is what it is. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You know, and once we get past a certain level, and I know you're safe, and you have the bond with the horse. Not to say that you don't need me anymore, but you don't need to do the sessions with me. Mm. I've gotten you to where you need to be to then go into the saddle. Mm. You go and work with Lauren, and I've given you the foundation, right? I've mm. given you all of these tools to now go and work with her and not be at ground zero, mm. to where she's not starting from scratch. Yeah. She's guiding you through and taking everything that we did on the ground, implementing it in the saddle now, giving you more tools, more confidence, and getting you to a point where, yeah, Colleen and Lori are going for a ride, and you're going to join them because yeah. you're there. I can't wait. Right? Come on, girl. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's fun. It is. It's good yeah, stuff. I can't wait. But I was going to say that a lot of places too. I think they don't focus on that groundwork. No. It's just, yeah. You know, you you show up and it's like, okay, you're going to get put on a horse. Right. Right. Yeah, it's pretty much it. And they lead the horse out and you get on. Yeah. You don't. Mm -hmm. You're not taught that safety or. All the things that I've mm -hmm. learned with Foxy and everything, I just don't think I would have gotten that anywhere else. Like, right. They I'm probably sure just would have right. caught me on the horse. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> so it's important. Lori wanted to ride. No, I want to ride. I, I don't want any of this. Okay. There are places out there. And she went, no, I want to do it here. <laughs> You're not. <laughs> right? And then that was a struggle for us where she's like, I want this. Okay, I hear you. Here's how you get that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not, I want this. Great. I give it to you. Right. And I even said, like, okay, so how long? Right. Yes. Sure. A month? I don't know. Six weeks? Nope. We'll see. No? No. <laughs> she said, when you're ready, when I think you're ready. Yep. And I just trusted her and said, okay, yep. let's do it. And oh my gosh, when I think about if I had gotten on a horse before.
before learning all this? You started yeah. in the best possible way. Absolutely. I know, I know. That I wish that was available when I was a Same. Kid, you know? This is what I wish I had. Yeah. You know, and I have people who are like, well, I've, I've ridden my whole life. That is awesome. You will probably breeze through this program then. Well, why do I even have to do it? Because you telling me you can ride has nothing That's to exactly. do right. with you showing me you can handle my horse. Right, right, right. I have to see yes. you handle the horse. So if you can halter the horse, and lead the horse and send the horse yep. and back the horse, then great. Yep. You, you're right, you don't need me. We might not get out in one session, but we're doing that yes. until we're not, and then you go work with Lauren. And then she's gonna do the same thing in the saddle. So that could be a month, and you're in the saddle, and you're off and, and on, and great. And, and but, or you could go home. The I'll thing swear, too is, this is how we do it here. Correct. Yeah. Is you created a bond that you never would have created. I know. Had you just know. got on. Yeah, mm -hmm. And you wouldn't have known of the stopping points yeah. and the, the the keys to keep you safe and the confidence to keep you safe. You were being yeah. given a language. Too. Yeah. I know, I know. I would not yeah. have had any of that. Mm -hmm. It would have been disaster. Mm -hmm. yeah. You wouldn't have the appreciation. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it would be a disaster because there are lots of folks well, out there that th I've ridden all my life. It would have been, I was thinking yeah. about me. Like, I want to mm -hmm. ride, I want to I wanna mm -hmm. get this out of it. And so, uh -huh. What she teaches is it's a relationship. Yes. And that's what I really want. Yeah. It, and that makes the run. Yep. So yes, much yes, better. yes. Yep. They're just getting on. Right, right. I just that's, can't imagine. There's yeah. no comparison. Mm -hmm. Yeah.